consider when planning a survey. First, is defining what the research objectives are. So what question are you trying to find out by using the survey? Second, is verifying that conducting a survey is the best way to go about answering your research question or objective. If, for example, that you've decided that a survey would be better because you don't need as in-depth detail that you would get from doing something such as a focus group or having someone do in-depth interviews, things like that. Third thing is deciding on or clarifying who is in your target sample out of the population that you're trying to survey. Is there a certain demographic within the population if you're trying to get a sample of that demographic from? So for example, are you conducting the survey as part of a community health assessment where you're trying to get a representative sample out of a larger population of the people in your community, asking them questions think about specific health issues or health in general? Are you just doing a customer satisfaction survey with your own customers? Or are you being even more specific and you only want to survey a small sample of your customers who purchase a specific product? Fourth thing to consider is deciding on your desired sample size for your survey. Deciding on sample size, you'll be working with your consultant to take into account factors such as what response rate would you expect to get, what confidence, or do you want a 95% confidence interval, but then come to realize you don't have the budget for that or you have time constraints where you need this done by a certain deadline, and you might have to be okay with having only a 90% confidence interval instead of a 95% confidence interval. Fifth is determining how you will conduct the survey based on your target sample you're trying to reach, what is the best way to reach them, a sample size you're trying to get, your budget, other resource constraints you may have, and other factors. Will this be an online survey? Will this be a paper survey that's mailed? Will it be a paper survey that might be left out in your waiting room for people to fill out? Or will it be conducted in another way that's best based on those factors that we mentioned?